the benefits of hormone therapy for women seems quite obvious. You know, every woman eventually goes through menopause. And when estradiol levels plunge, progesterone levels plunge, testosterone levels plunge, we start to see significant changes from loss of energy, to hot flashes, to poor sleep, to brain fog, to just, you know, not feeling like yourself, which you had from your 20s to somewhere in the 40s, late 40s to early 50s, uh, commonly is when we see this. So weight gain, gee, I can't get those, those 10 pounds off or 20 pounds off or even worse. And so, um, you know, there's a lot of fairly common symptoms that we see across the board. What we don't see is a silent inflammation. The number one killer of women over 50 is a heart attack. Well, why is that? Well, because without adequate estradiol and testosterone to a certain degree, the vessels uh, become stiff. So increased risk of heart attack and stroke. Certainly, you know, the whole cancer issue was a big discussion that, that we could probably expound on at a later time. But we know that with natural bioidentical compounds, those risks are much less, that we can restore vitality, that we can improve body composition, muscle mass. You know, you're never too old to build muscle mass. You just need adequate hormone levels, adequate testosterone to do that. We measure human growth hormone. There's both therapeutic and homeopathic products that we utilize that actually are effective. And so um, it is a big deal. One of the most important is osteoporosis, you know, falling, the risk of fracture, the drugs and compounds that Big Farm likes to push for that. Unfortunately, very do very little to grow new ball. They may slow down the rate, but actually the rate of hip fracture is worse on patients taking these bifosphonates. And so it you can be behind between a rock and a hard place with trying to help someone that's developed osteoporosis and perhaps there is an honor for small number of reasons can't take it uh, to prevent osteoporosis. But in the 20 years that I've done this, I and I have a number of women into their 80s, um, not one of my patients, female patients, has osteoporosis because they have an adequate estradiol, progesterone, testosterone, and their bone health is, is great. And so um, those are the main things that, that, you know, I think of. And then psychosocially, how do you interact with your mate? How do you interact with the kids and grandkids and things when you, you just have no energy? And so it is um, real rewarding from my seat to be able to, to help women that are aging, that uh, to you know reduce or eliminate those, a lot of those symptoms, and and they can be quite significant. So it's uh, it's fun, and then, and then I see a lot of older couples, and there's nothing better from my standpoint than having vitality back in the relationship with a husband and wife that have been together 20, 30, 40 years, and so it's it's. Uh, uh, I love doing that.